Hi, my name is Linda Perry and I've been invited by Consortium Music to demonstrate for you these beautiful power flutes. The power signature features include a solid sterling silver head joint and crown, body, foot and mechanism, rings, ribs, barrel and posts, the whole shebang. The tubing thickness is 0.16 which is standard. It has drawn tone holes, B foot joint with a gizmo key, a modern power scale which is beautifully even, traditional pinned mechanism with adjustment screws. All the keywork material is sterling silver. It has an offset G, French open ring cups, pointed arms, C-sharp trill, split E, and the springs are 10 karat white gold. It also has the Pisoni S2 standard pads, which are the Straubinger style pads. It's 925 silver. Everything is 925 silver. And it has white gold springs, which provide a really lovely light action. What I love about this flute, when I first played it, I it just was easy to play. It just has a lovely, beautiful, immediate response right through the range. Let me see if I can show you. So from the low register and then up into the upper register, it just is even and beautiful. So it's a real pleasure to play. And I haven't been playing this flute for very long, so uh, it, it really is something that you can pick up and play quite effortlessly right from the first note. The key work that I mentioned, it's got a lovely light action. And that's one thing that I first noticed when I first came into contact with power flutes. So I might show you something that potentially has uh, a bit more about of that responsiveness of the articulation with um, the fast movement of the keys. So straight away, it's really easy to play um, with a nice clean response with fast double tonguing and fast movement of fingers. So it's quite free playing. So with a silver flute, Initially, I thought that the low register may not be quite as warm as I would want it to be. A little disclosure here, I actually play the Auramite version of a PAL professional flute, so I really love the warmth of the gold and what that gives me in all registers, but particularly the warmth of the low register. But playing the 925 silver flute, I was quite surprised how warm this low register was. Let me show you. It's also quite flexible. So if I show you a little bit of an exercise that um, can maybe move from that lower part of the range and show you some more intervallic movement, you can see that it moves very smoothly then from that low register up into the higher registers. So it's quite easy to move between jumps on the instrument. If I show you how it performs in the high range, it's got a lovely bright, but still very full sound in the high register. A little bit of Peter and the Wolf for you. So it's a lovely big bright sound with a lot of presence, but it also has um, enough fatness, which is always what I'm looking for when I'm playing in the high register. So often when you're trying a new flute, you want to know how much resistance there is against the sound. As I said in the opening, this has a beautiful ease of tone production. There's not much resistance I don't find against the sound. So I want to just show you how the flute works with say a beautiful big crescendo diminuendo. So 
again quite easy to produce the initial sound and then I felt that the leading edge of the lip plate there really gave me a lot, I could really push and I was also able to get a beautiful diminuendo right to um, almost nothing. So very happy with my ability to be able to push the sound and to create a, a big dynamic range, even just with a low A. It really does feel like there is quite a wide dynamic range there. And I'd like to show you maybe just some different tone colors to see, because we, we also like to, with a professional flute, know that we can create sort of some harder qualities of sound, but also some beautiful, delicate nuance. So I'll show you just a bit of an excerpt that might show some of that difference of quality. So some very delicate colours, some more moody, smoky sort of colours. And again, you can create some brighter, fuller quality there as well. So I feel there's quite a large dynamic range. So it's definitely an instrument to give you a lot back. Definitely worth trying for someone that's looking for a professional range flute that's stepping up from that intermediate level and really looking to be a serious flute player. When you're looking for a new professional flute, it's good to try all of the different options available. And the wonderful thing about the power range is there are so many customized head joint options that you can interchange with the various bodies. So I might demonstrate for you just a short excerpt with a few of the different head joint options. So you can hear the various tone colors that are available. So I'll show you with the 925 silver that comes with the 925 flute at the moment and then show you the other options. This next option is the Oromite head joint and I own an Oromite power flute and I absolutely love it. This has the combination of the nine carat rose gold on the exterior and the 925 silver in the interior. Now this is not a regular plated flute, this is a special bonded metal that's fused together in a special process that Powell actually invented. So let's see what this can produce. The head joint that I have on the flute now is the 925 head joint with a 14 carat lip and riser. It has the venti cut, which seems to be one of the more popular Powell head joint cuts that is available. Let's see what you think. To me, I feel that gives me a little bit more warmth to the sound. This next head joint is the nine carat gold custom flute head joint, and it also has the venti cut. This last head joint, you may notice, looks a little different. It is the quite special Grenadilla custom head joint and I think this would be my next passion purchase. I just find the warmth of the wood is really something quite special and it's surprising that it really does still have fantastic projection. professional flutes come with these beautiful cases 
we have the internal case with a special locking mechanism that is really easy to open with one hand. I do really like that. And it also comes with its own little key if you want that extra protection. It also has the external case with a zip that opens fully flat. So no more having to take out the internal case from the soft case. You can open up the case fully, nice and flat, and the case won't tip over with the flute inside. You also have a couple of beautiful soft cloths, um, really lovely soft fabric, and a lovely ebony rod for your cleaning rod in its own little sock. It's very cute. So lots of beautiful accessories to go with the professional power flutes. So if you'd like to try out any of these options, get in touch with Consortium Music. I'm sure Joe would love to help you out to select your new beautiful instrument.